What's up everyone, it's Hector here again with another anime figure review or video game figure review. And this time I have Professor Oak with Bulbasaur from Kotobukiya and Art FXJ, part of the Pokemon figure series. And uh, well, the, it has the Japanese name on it. It says Professor Okido with Fushigidane. And the illustration is by Hitoshi Ariga. And sculpture is by, sculpture of Professor Okido is by Takahi. And the sculpture of Fushigidane is by Koei, Koei Matsumoto, I suppose. So like all the other ones from the Pokemon figure series, uh, there has there's an illustration on one side of the box, pictures of the actual figure on the other side, and then some Pokeball windows on the top and then on another side, and then a big window on the front so you can see the figure without actually having to open up the box. But I'm going to open it up anyways. Because that's how I roll and I like to display my figures. And like all the other Art FXJ Pokemon figure series, inside the box there's a picture of the Pokemon that comes with the figure and then it says the name of the figure. This one says Professor Okido with Fushigidane. So here we have Professor Oak with Bulbasaur and a little encyclopedia that actually kind of looks like the Pokedex but it's an actual book because remember the Pokedex is an electronic encyclopedia and then there's little uh what do you call those? Markers? Book? Well, I'll, I'll try and do a close-up. All right, so there's a little imprint inside the book. So you just slide the book in his hand, and then it just fits like that. Kind, kind of snugly, but not super secure. And then we have Bulbasaur doing a vine whip. And so Professor Oak's base is actually purple. Maybe it's because his shirt is purple, or maybe because there's red, blue, and green red and blue makes purple but then that kind of kind of would leave out green i guess but yeah so yeah this is professor oak figure screwed to the base like all the other trainer figures in the pokemon figure series from kotobuhia and art fxj and uh let's take a closer look as always kotobuhia provides you with a beautiful figure with excellent sculpting and perfect painting all of it is a hard PVC plastic, except for Professor Oak's coat, which is a little bit flexible, and Bulbasaur's vines. The Professor Oak figure is just under 19 centimeters tall, or almost 8 inches, and the Bulbasaur sculpture is about 4 centimeters tall, or 1 and 3 quarters of an inch, but if you include the vines, it goes up to 6 centimeters tall, or 2 and a half inches. So as you can see, the book in Professor Oak's hands looks pretty similar to the Pokedex, but it's still an actual book. So I guess they compromised on Professor Oak doing his lifelong research on Pokemon and also kind of showing a Pokedex. But it might have been cool if he was handing out a Pokedex to the trainers alongside him. And here we have the complete set from Kotobukiya and Art FXJ in the Pokemon series line of figures. We have Red from the Fire Red remake, Professor Oak, and Blue or Leaf from the Leaf Green remake. And the Pokemon that are included are Charmander, Bulbasaur, and Squirtle. So that's pretty much it for this Professor Oak figure with Fushigidane, part of the Kotobukiya Art FXJ and Pokemon figure series. Again, it was sculpted by Takahi for Professor Oak and uh, Koei Matsumoto for Fushigidane. And uh, illustration is Hitoshi Ariga. It's one eighth scale pre-painted figure, part of this three-piece set, but then it's also part of a larger set of the Pokemon figure series from Kotobukiya and Art FXJ. I'll try and find a listing on Amazon for the Professor Oak figure. If I can find a listing, I'll put the link in the description, and if you want to buy it, use my link and I'll get a small cut of it, but it won't co cost you anything extra. It'll just help keep my websites and my YouTube channels running. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it or appreciated it, and you can subscribe to my channel for more content, more collectible reviews, and when this pandemic ends, I'd like to go to a convention, look at more collectibles, more cosplay, and all that good stuff. So yeah, subscribe if you want to see that. See y'all later, and keep on collecting.